As you guys just saw in that short clip, I was tapping on something with a pen and it was lighting up a light bulb. This is called piezoelectricity. In this video, I'm going to be demoing a project I built using piezoelectricity and explaining exactly how it works. So, let's jump right into it. Now for an explanation of how this actually works, let's take a close up look at the piezoelectric light bulb. So over here we have our light bulb, two wires connecting to it that are positive and negative, and here is our piezoelectric disc. So the components of our piezoelectric disc are one golden metal plate right over here, and then another metal plate right over here that's white in color, and if you look close enough with like angled light, you can see a dark golden covered layer right over here. That dark golden layer is a piezoelectric material. Now, this material is very special because of its molecular structure. When you compress it, negative charges collect at the bottom and positive charges collect at the top. This is because the way that the atoms are arranged are unsymmetrical. So, when we compress it, positive charges collect at the top, which is then harnessed through the metal disc, and negative charges at the bottom, which is also harnessed through the metal disc, and then run through the wires to our light bulb. So now, if we take a real life example of this image, we can see two pairs of atoms, and both are unsymmetrical, but one is where no force is applied, which is on the left, and one is where there is force applied, which is on the right. So in the left, where there's no force applied, you can see that the charge is net zero, but the atoms are still unsymmetrical, which is a key feature in piezoelectric materials. But in the right side, where there is force applied, being to the sides, which is being compressed, you can see a net positive charge at the top and a net negative charge at the bottom. This is then, as I said, run through the metal plates, through the wires, and then to a light bulb, or whatever you want to light up. Now, this is a very brief explanation of PA's electricity. So if you want to go more in depth, you can check out this article I wrote on the explanation of PA's electricity, and this article I wrote on the explanation of this exact project. Both of these will be linked in the description down below. You guys saw a little sneak peek of the actual demonstration of the project in the beginning of the video, but here is the actual clips of it, so enjoy. Hope you guys enjoyed this different kind of video and I will be posting more content just like this so stay tuned.